Tail length describes how long your board is behind your rear trucks. More specifically, tail length is the projected distance from the tip of the tail to the centers of the truck holes closest to the tail. Some people measure this along the curve of the tail, but we use the projected view in SkateCAD. Longer tails provide space for your back foot behind the trucks, so you can more easily pivot your board, pop it up, or secure your back foot past the trucks, which is needed for tricks like tail slides and dropping in. A longer tail will also reduce the pop angle, which is the angle your board makes with the ground when you pop it up during an ollie. This can create a more responsive feel where it takes less effort to do tricks and pivot. Shorter tails make the board shorter overall, a little lighter, and increase the pop angle. The steeper pop angle will create a more powerful feel which can help make it feel easier to pop the board up off the ground. Also, if you're building boards, reducing the tail length can give you more space for your wheelbase without needing to use longer material to cut your boards from. If you're not sure where to begin, here's a quick tip. Choose a tail length of around 6.75 inches if you want to do more tricks or want to be able to easily pivot when cruising. Choose a tail length of around two to four inches if you'd like to maximize your wheelbase and don't want to pivot or do ollie based tricks. As with every board spec, you'll need to experiment to really figure out what works best for you. To start experimenting with tail length, visit SkateCAD at skatecad.com.